what is going on everybody and welcome back to the freaking channel oh my god rudolph has came out to hey <laughs> it is like 5 30 in the morning right now it's pretty freaking early the earliest i woke up to go fishing ever and i'm hurting right now but anyway guys today i have a freaking pretty special video for you guys because uh today my buddy is taking me out for my very first time on his boat and is possibly going to put me on my very first freaking catfish now i've been trying to catch these catfish this will be my third time trying to catch them but today i am getting on my first freaking catfish i know he's going to do it i've seen his pictures on facebook and he catches tanks but before we get into today's video do me a favor hit that like button smash that subscribe button and leave a comment down below of what you guys want to see next and I will be back in a few days with some more content for you guys. We're going to be fishing on the Susquehanna. He has a nice catfish boat that he's going to take me out on today and show me the ropes. I really don't know what I'm doing. I've only catfished my, uh, one time when I was younger. And I think I was like 12 years old at the time. But I got a long drive ahead of me. Sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. All right, guys, we have freaking made it. As you guys can see behind me, that's the freaking boat ramp. Let's go check it out, actually. I, this is my first time ever being here. This looks like, this dock is beautiful. Like, I could fish here all day, and the river is flowing. So I feel like we, I have a really good feeling about today. I feel like we're really going to get on them. Dang, Rudolph, I didn't know it was Christmas already. I haven't been on a boat probably since I was, like, 12 years old, so gonna be a freaking doozy hopefully i don't get sick i i think i'll be fine the boat is here this is our ride for the day but he got a nice boat i can't wait i'm freaking excited guys we just gotta get to this channel it's like super shallow here and then once we get out yep i'm ready to go <laughs> I haven't. I just like get some rods in the water and then I'll like right. talk about it or explain or whatever. Right. I, mean, I don't know what you want to know, but I mean. I mean, I think uh, I just wanted to learn like the setups, but I think I, I literally do the same thing. Yeah, I have the same setup because you just throw usually a weight on where that hook yeah, is, it's just right? A, yeah, it's just a sinker slide, the bump stop to keep it from tearing up my knot. Uh, I have 65 pound braid uh, and then a uh, 50 mono. Okay. Oh, I didn't see it. I didn't know that you had to rig up like that. that? I, I was rigging up with only like 20 pound mono. Oh, yeah, yeah, Do you put rattles on yours? I haven't, no, but I, uh... See, I just went to them, and I've noticed, like, a pretty... No I've seen a pretty noticeable difference. Okay. Because I didn't just break all my rods and put them on. I would just, like, as the line... Because you get, you get hung up in rocks and you lose them all the time. Yeah. And so as they would break, then I slowly added them. And at one point, I just had like two or three with rattles on, and they were consistently getting fish. <laughs> the other ones weren't. I wonder why. So I'm pretty, I'm pretty sold on them. <laughs> so I usually just cut the tail off because yeah. if it's out there in current and the tail's still there, yeah. it'll just like twist your line. Oh, okay. I need to put all that into my. Like for channels, I use like a six aught hook, and then for flatheads, like a nine or a ten. Insane. So it'll tap a little bit at first, but when they bite it, I mean the rod will be like. Sheesh! <laughs> there's a fish right there. There's one messing with it. Um, so like if it's just like tapping and just like halfway down, but it's still like moving around, you just leave the rod in the rod holder and cr just reel. And if the tip goes all the way down, then you know he's hooked. Uh, but if it just like destroys the rod, you can just take it out. <laughs> just go to town. So you know, the funny thing is, I set a goal for this year to not get skunked. That was my goal for this year on the boat. Have you ever got skunked yet? Not this year. Oh, I've been skunked a few times this year. <laughs> Say something funny. So I got him at Bass Pro. Whoa, 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 whoa. That's crazy. You got nuts on it. That's freaking Oh, This is. I need a boat now. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good sign that uh, they're out. Yeah, one already. We've been here 20 minutes. Oh, yeah. that's getting tapped right on. Yep, that's a good So I'll just let it go for uh, now. He's swimming with it. You can see the line going back and forth in the water. 
Go ahead and reel down on him. Yep. Oh. I felt a little bit, but nothing. Yeah, try reeling down on him. See if, see if he's there. Ah, he's there. Yeah, go ahead, take it out. Help. Oh. Jeez, is that a rock or is that? That's a fish. Oh my gosh. Oh. <laughs> yeah, he's when he pulls, just go ahead and let him let him do his thing. Oh, so like real now? Uh, when he uh, just when he backs down, when he gives you some. Uh... Holy jeez! Oh yeah, he's a nice one. Oh man! <laughs> yeah, it is. There he is. Let's go. Whoo. Jeez. Grab him right inside like they have it. Let me just get him. Just roll the hook out here. Boy, it's my first flathead ever. Oh my gosh. That's a much bigger fight than a freaking bass, man. He said. 18? That's my guess. Ugh. Swore it's not locking out, but it's at 20. 20 right on it. There you go. All right. Yes, thank you. You get a picture, please? Oh, All right, boys, there he is. Oh, we're going to let him go back to her home, his or her home. Got a rough spot. Yeah, they're spawning right now, so those they're just getting all beat up just from them spawning. Oh, so, okay. All right. Oh, my gosh. I'm already addicted. <laughs> Not quite a bass fight, huh? Heck no. I thought it was a freaking rock. All right, guys. I had to change the battery. We are back. We just had a takedown, but he robbed the bait. You got the camo Crocs on. Yeah, I usually wear no socks, but not today. <laughs> thought about getting a pair for fishing. Hey, man, this is no better fishing shoe. <laughs> oh, he was just yeah, sitting. Here, here, take it, take it, take it. Uh, yeesh. He was just chilling. He was just chilling on there. He just, <laughs> he didn't want, he really like didn't. Oh, Jeez. Yeah, he's fighting different. Definitely not a wet see sock. How, see how he's at the top of the water? Oh, I didn't even see him. He, uh, yeah, see how he's rolling at like the top? Yeah. He's just a little guy. Woo! There you go. Multi species, guys. Woo! Boys, a channel catfish. We got two different kinds. Woo! Like these bumps right here, almost. Look like pimples. Yeah. That's fish lice. There's just like a little parasite that gets in under their skin. Oh wow. It's not harmful to us. All right. Going to get this guy back. Those ones you can just toss in. Oh. Nice. <laughs> well, I'm already having a hell of a day. <laughs> All right, guys. We are currently moving to the second spot of the day. The first spot, uh, we had five, five, I think five bites in total. Two of the fish landed. The other three robbed us for our bait. But yeah, guys, all we're doing is moving to spots. I'll catch you guys when we get to the next spot. My kayak goal is to catch 20 pounds on a kayak. Oh, yeah, that'll be, <laughs> that'll be a fight. Yeah. Felt like the one from earlier. Oh, uh, it might be. No. Are you making ground up on it? Yeah. 
That's a fish. Oh my god, yes, it's a fish. Is it? Yep. Yep. Crap, that would be a nice one. Take your time. Is he stuck now? <laughs> nah, he's just he's good digging. <laughs> Holy crap. Oh my gosh. Does he feel stronger than the other one? Yeah, like I'll, I I don't know if we're stuck now. Is that stuck? Is that a fish? Did you feel movement at all? Yeah, Is I felt a head shake. Definitely. I want to say he's still on. Oh, yeah, he's. Yeah. Holy crap. Oh, oh you I don't want to break your rod. You're not going to break my rod. Oh, my gosh. I just, just don't. Grab, grab the line. Oh, like, the line. I think I'm stuck now. No, you're good. Unless it's just a tank. You said you did feel head shakes. Yeah, I definitely felt head shakes. Oh yeah, there he is. Go ahead. Oh, there. <laughs> yes. Oh my gosh. What a big sucker. Yeah, so what I just go ahead and put him down in the lower deck area. Oh, so oh. he can't flip off the boat. So sometimes they'll yeah, they'll go under like a big rock or something. So if you just open the bale. Okay. That way they have free line, they'll come back out. I know I felt him. <laughs> Woo! Second one of the well, second flathead, yeah. Oh. Yeah, he really took that rock down. Yeah, man. he did. <laughs> Got the skill zeroed out. Not quite. Yeah. Not locking out, but I'm getting 19, 19.4. All right. Got me my first catfish one. That did get you good? Not good, but enough to make me bleed. Big, hey. but just the fact that we had three fish. Whoa! Oh my gosh. Yeah, you can go ahead. You no, grill it. Uh -huh. I just wasn't sure if you were going to get there in time. Oh my gosh. <sighs> Oh, this one's not as big as the other. I think it might be a channel, though. He hit hard. Ah, uh, it's got to be a flatty. Uh, yeah, you never he's... know. They, sometimes they don't feel like a fight, and then they get to the boat, and then it's like game on. Oh, yeah. <sighs> Try to keep him away from that anchor rope. Yep, yeah, like, just like that. They don't like the boat. Oh, buddy. Woo! Oh, I think this is the big one of the day. That's the big one? Look at the belly on it. Oh, my gosh. Woo! I might need the glove for that one. <laughs> That last one ripped me up Look at the good. belly on him. I'm saying 23. 23? He might even be bigger than that, but I'm going to be conservative at 23. He might be like 26. Oh now I'm going to try and be accurate and say 26. <laughs> see how good I can guess. Look at these. 24. Right at 24, it's bouncing from 23 to 24. Yeah, it's like 23.9. Jeez! Oh my gosh, buddy. Fighter. Yeah, yeah. See, I didn't bring my gloves specifically because I didn't want to be a b today. But. Desperate time calls for desperate pain. <laughs> yeah, my finger is sore right now. 23 freaking pounds, boys and girls. Oh my gosh. Oh, he's right. Oh, come on, buddy. That is a powerful fish. Oops. That's a fish. Good. Take it. You might have to tie it 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yes. Oh, this one is shaking crazy. This is a baby. Oh, this is a little guy. It's a little guy. Guys, look at this guy. He's just a little guy. I don't think I'm going to snap a picture with him because he's just a little sucker. But let him back. Probably, what would you guess? Weight wise. Uh, he's probably like five pounds. Five pounds? All right, we'll let you go, buddy. A little fella. Yeah, it's this really nice down here. Oh, oh, oh. There we go. Is that? Yeah. It looks like he's messing with it. Yeah, yeah, go ahead and reel one. Yeah, he's got him. Got him. Got him. You'll just bring him right in the middle. I'll just catch on that in here. Oh, I think it's a baby. Fish. It's a fish, that's all that matters. It's got gills, anything with gills, we take them. <laughs> exactly. Come on, little guy. Unless you're just going to dig it then. 60 pounder, he's just not fighting. Oh, yeah. <laughs> He's as big as he is. Yeah, he's just, look at that, boys. Oh, I am recording. Little baby one. All right, we're gonna let this little guy back. All right, he was ready to go, he got me. So if you were tournament fishing, you'd have 62 pounds right now. He's a 62 pound bag. Oh my. Oh yeah, we got him this time. Oh, yeah, that might be. Maybe not. It's definitely not bigger than the ones earlier. Oh, he's up at the surface. It's a channel. Bigger than the one from earlier for sure. Oh, he spit it. Wow. That's the channel that we were after all day. Dang. How many times has that happened to you? Uh, not too often. Not too often? Nah, I don't catfish. Uh, might have been just a little too aggressive when he was up at the top. Oh, so when they're up at the top like that, just let them work themselves? Yeah. Or? Okay. I think that's the bass fisherman in you, though. Yeah. <laughs> just skiing them. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys, that is going to conclude our video. I was out, well, my buddy Matt, he got a YouTube channel coming soon, Nuclear Catfish with a freaking K. Go check him out. I'll put the link down below. And guys, yeah, like I said, man, I just want to thank you again for taking me out and put me on, what, five catfish today? Uh, yeah. Three, six. Six, six? Six. Five, six? five or six. Today I caught six catfish total. Five flatheads and one channel catfish. We had a couple bites at the end, but they just weren't fully committing. Three of them were 20 pounders. Well, one was right under 20 pounds. Uh, two, uh, the other one was 25, and the other one was 20 even. Then we had a couple baby flatheads. But yeah guys, before we get out of here, do me a favor, hit that like button, smash that subscribe button, and leave a comment down below of what your PB flathead is. But anyway guys, it's been real. It's your bull, Barry. Peace. Let's